Hello everyone, it's Monday. It's time for us to fly into the night. Um, okay, hi. Actually, I'm gonna put this over here. I'm lazy, I don't wanna have to go and get my, uh, tripod. So, this week is, I mean, um, it's Monday, it's Victoria Day, so I don't have any school, and so I didn't really want to do my hair, and since it is crazy hat week, um, it doesn't really matter if I do my hair. I'm just doing homework, it is extremely dull, and I think I'm almost done. I think someone just dropped something. Um, I don't have any challenges. I'm gonna do Harry Potter history now. Have you noticed that my videos have been relatively short now? Do you like that? I kind of like that. That's less editing for me. What is today? 23rd. My mom just got home. Okay. Uh, May 24th in 1993, Harry and Ron follow the spiders into the Forbidden Forest and meet Aragog. Uh, May 24th, 1995, Bartimius Crouch. Do you say Bartimus or Bartimius? I haven't decided. I'm just gonna, gonna say Barty. Barty Crouch Sr. is murdered by his son, Barty Crouch Jr., transfigured into a bone and buried in Hagrid's garden. May 25th, uh, 1992, Harry overhears Quirrell arguing with Lord Voldemort and assumes that Severus Snape is threatening Quirrell. May 26th, 1992, Harry, Hermione, Neville, and Draco serve detention with Hagrid in the Forbidden Forest. They see a dead unicorn and Harry encounters Lord Voldemort for the first time since infancy. Okay? Okay. Um, so today is May 23rd, and it's Dramini Day, uh, as said by Dramini Team on Twitter. Um, yeah, it's Dramini Day. I've been watching a lot of The Office. Ooh! I just remembered something. So, um, there's this all caps song, and I love all caps, and if you watch this, you should know that I love all caps. But I love all caps, and they have this one called, so, called, this one song called You Kissed Me at the Dundies. And of course, me not knowing what that meant, but I, I kind of gathered that it was about The Office because it was like the Dundies, and I knew that the paper company that they worked for was called Dunder Mifflin, so I figured Dundies, Dunder Mifflin. But now that I've actually watched it, I know the entire song. I know like how it goes. Like I understand what's happening. Um, and so if you haven't heard it, and you know relatively what happens in the office, you should go on iTunes and buy it and listen to it. And it's on YouTube, but it's just like a stupid music video thing that someone made with dolls and it looks kind of strange, but I don't know. Listen to it, don't watch the video. Um, yeah, it's really pretty. Steph, don't watch it if you're watching this before you come over, because Steph's coming over today, and I'm gonna show it to her. And we're gonna go, yay, I wanna make a music video for it. I'm gonna play Pam. Steph's gonna play Dwight, and I think we want a Jim and a Michael. I was thinking Erica would be Jim because she has boy hair. No offense, Erica. It's true. You know it's true. Um, yeah. So, challenges. Okay. Um, Kelly helped me think of this. Oh, and Jess had a good idea for a um, theme, but I didn't have time to do her theme, so maybe it'll be next week, okay? It, it's fancy hat day, weird hat day, whatever. I mean, week. Uh, I'm so bleh. My room is really messy, I need to, I was getting onto this. More tangents, more tangents, Robin. Jeez. Okay. Uh, what was Kelly's challenge? Oh, someone to, um, give an interpretation of their favorite YouTuber. And I know a lot of people are going to do Toby Turner because he's really easy to do. But don't do Toby Turner. Okay? Do like the Shaytards or something. And those Shaytards be hard. Connor. Charlie is so cool like. Fresned. Fresned would be easy to do too. I think someone's coming down the stairs. I'm going to. Huh? Hi! What? Hi! Yeah? Hi! Hi! How's it going? Good. Good. What are you 
making my video. Well, I guess it is that time of the week, isn't it? Yep. I gotta have a warm up bath. Okay. It's frozen cold rain. Okay. Whole time. What did you guys have for lunch? What? What did you have for lunch? Um. Uh. I made myself cheese whiz toast. And what did Kelly have? What have you got for me to read in here while I have a hot bath? Lots of stuff. No, that's right. You want to read something? No, nothing that you read. I have Twilight. I'm good. I'm mocking Jay. All right. Oh, today was Super Mega Foxy Asmot. Well, it will be Super Mega Foxy Asmot Wing. Uh, Steph comes over. I think she's working right now. She's coming over after she's done working. Um, yes. So, happy Germany Day. Um, speaking of Germany Day, why don't you celebrate it by reading Steph's fan fiction? Links in the. Yeah. Hey. I'm vlogging here. Links. Links in the swan. The Dharma Initiative swan hatch. Win. I was watching The Office and uh, there's this part where they make, they made a couple Harry Potter references. I think they made two Harry Potter references. And, in case I get bored, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. No, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Question. Prison Mike. What's the very, very worst thing about prison? Don't encourage him, don't. The worst thing about prison was the, was the Dementors. They were flying all over the place and they were scary and then they'd come down and they sucked the soul out of your body and then height! Deme Dementors like in Harry Potter? No, not Harry Potter. There are no movies in prison. And then they made a Lost reference. I was watching this one part and he was going to do like initiation. Dwight was trying to in initiate Ryan and he's just like, why did this guy who, the guy who founded Dunder Mifflin kill himself? And he's just like, depression? No, false. He hated himself. Okay, last question. What is the Dharma initiative? And I was like, to the things she says and the things she does. Win. Depression? Wrong. He hated himself. What is the Dharma initiative? Okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave. I'm on... An abundance of Catherine's, but it's less inappropriate than looking for Alaska, and that's good. I'm gonna leave now. I think so. Ready for a video? Let it be clear. Hey, he's vlogging. He. Hey. Ooh. Hey. Um. Also, I've just discovered Hey Molly by Michael Lombardo, and it's so. Adorable. It is the best love song I've ever heard. And I can't believe it took me this long to discover that song, but it was gorgeous. Um, okay, I'm gonna leave. I'm probably annoying the crap out of you. So, DFTVA, where the odds be having your favorite, Draco Dominion, Sun Code to the Landis, uh, 4 8 15 16 23 42, execute, and Christian, I will see you tomorrow.